I me, I don't understand the point of letting Vivian into the house again when you know that she can never ever change. Men, this family have the money to um for Mark to rent an apartment and stay far from the house. I don't get it. Now, Vivian is like a lion or a bomb. How will I even say? That you know that can never change. A snake can never change. You know that there is no way that you that an enemy can just change overnight. You understand? If you want to help an enemy, help the enemy from outside, not bringing the person inside. Okay, now, at this point, now, Vivian is still determined. Like, she's still... She's still using any opportunity, anyhow. She, you, we all know that she have the remote to remote Mark. And Mark, when they press that Mumu button like this, Mark head will turn. Mark will dance to her tone. Ask me if Vivian is not a witch. Ask me, how come um, Chris proposing to Helen become a problem to her? How is this supposed to be a problem to her? Vivian, her own, is saying, um, Helen is your sister. Vivian is still telling Mark, Helen is not your sister. These people are not your family. Like Mark dancing again. Now Mark is now asking himself question. Why would Chris propose to Helen without telling him? I don't understand. You lost that good relationship when you decide to act negatively. And he told you that you're not worthy to be his friend again. Like if 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 since you are normal, you expect oh both of you will discuss this at men. In fact, you don't even hold you an explanation. Now Vivian has made Mark to understand that uh, it's because Chris wants to take over the house. That if Chris marries Helen, that Chris is going to take over the house. And Helen on her own now. Is there carrying family matter on her head and not thinking about herself? Most people are like that. But let's make that change. Love your neighbor as you love yourself, not more than yourself. Family matter will always be there. Family matter will ask. Mama rightly advised her. He said, get married. Chris is a good man. Even uncle told her the same thing. Family matter will always be there. And mama, okay, mama, okay, mama said, okay, I'll go with you. Now she's saying, what of Ben and Mark? She wants to carry Ben and Mark and go. Okay, since now she's safe with mama, she's safe with Ben, she's safe with Mark. That is to say that in her head, everybody, all of them have understand and accept that Vivian is the only problem they are having, right? Why can't they let Vivian go? Then if Mark wants to go with Vivian, he can go with Vivian. You know, I don't understand this whole thing. Then uh, Nick on his own is just trying to tell Ben to just calm down, uh, do this one, don't take it too far. And Ben said a very powerful thing. That at times he look at himself in the mirror. Eh? When you look at his self, in his self at the mirror, he no longer realize, recognize himself. He no longer, that is what Vivian now, Vivian, evil have overshadowed, overshadowed him that when she look at herself, it's only evil, evil that she's saying. So as Ben at this moment, Ben, anytime Ben look at her, his face, he's no longer see Ben. What he's seeing is somebody that wants to revenge, somebody that wants to revenge. You understand? Your thoughts becomes your real self, your action and your words. When, when your, your thoughts, it, it affects a whole lot about you. That is why when person is angry, when you're angry, if somebody look at you, the person will know you're angry. When you talk, the person will know that you, you, you are angry. When you even write, the person will know that you're angry. You, that's how anger and revenge can actually control your life. You understand what I'm saying? So now, Nick on his own is just trying to calm uh, Ben down. And Ben, at his own side, wants to take over, over everything. The company and everything. And I ask again, why is it taking so long to read the will? Why is it taking so long for Mark and Vivian to just go out and just stay at their own pace? Why? I don't even understand the whole thing. <clears throat> you get. And then Vivian is still there planning upon planning. Mama on her own have told Helen, Go. Uncle gave an advice. Yes. Um, divorce is very bad. But when that is is okay to leave that marriage when you're still alive. You have to live to live. 
don't think about what the society will say because when you when that marriage ends you the society will still say something and then he laid a course on vivian it's not better you know it's just <laughs> he laid a course on vivian that since vivian have decided to come and put um um disaster in their family that crisis in their family that vivian will run mad that is what he said that is the acting, the person, the acting vision, not the person acting it. You understand? So, for me, I think letting Vivian go out of the house could have solved all this. But they decide to take their enemy inside and then it's hurting them. You get? I don't know what you think about this episode, but I said that they should just put a stop to the, to the radiance. How would I call it? To Vivian. And everybody will be all right. That is just this, and thanks for the, um, Uncle, thank you so much for the advice you give to married people. It's actually, it's actually a yes, like, at times, you keep on fighting what you cannot, what you know you cannot put an end to, and you lose yourself. And at times, we keep on to, we want to revenge, then we lost our real self in the art of revenge, and we become somebody that we are not supposed to be. The, that's why the society changes us even more than the home training. <laughs> How will I put it? I love you so very much, guys. Thank you so much for everything. The, the, the love is massive. Put on YouTube and on Facebook. I love you so very much. Continue to share, like, and follow. I love you. Bye-bye.